Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to another video. We are going to be opening here three of the uh, Pokemon Go starter kits here or starter packs. Uh, really don't know what it's called to be honest, uh, but you essentially just get three promo cards. We're actually, yes, opening up all three of them. Uh, this is for Pokemon Go, so I think this is just going to be very exciting because I do like the alternate way it's actually been designed um, with it specifically being for Pokemon Go. We have our three promos, uh, Squirtle, Bulbasaur and Charmander. We are also going to be getting pins for them as well. But you know, this is just the outside of the box. You guys have already probably seen these in stores and are probably wondering what's actually in here. So with that being said, let's just get this all opened up and uh, see what we actually get. Alright, so here's everything we have. Uh, so this side is the Charmander side of things. We have over here our Bulbasaur side as well. And we have over here our Squirtle side. So this is all really interesting here, seeing what we actually have. Uh, really unsure of all these things. So let me just put all the packs and that all up there for the sec And we also have our pins as well. So let's actually take a look at all of our pins first. So we have here our Squirtle uh, We have our Charmander and we have our Bulbasaur uh, Definitely really nice here. I love the actual designs of these uh, very Pokemon Go-esque uh, with how they're actually designed. Very nice that we also get uh, two pins at the back as well. Uh, it seems like this is a new thing. It seems like all pins now are actually designed to have two at the back. Just makes it less likely for it to get lost if you were to actually stick it onto something. So definitely really pleased with how they're designing them. But what I don't like though is how you can actually see the back of the rubber. So let me just get this focused up here for you guys. You can see the rubber right here. And that's definitely not a great thing. So uh, definitely unfortunate there. But with that being said, uh, it's a very minor detail. And from a distance, it won't be too big of a deal. But, you know, up close, it doesn't look nice to have it. The only one that doesn't show is actually Bulbasaur. But uh, yeah, with that being said, it's really nice to have all these, so I'm just going to set these aside for the time being, just so that we have enough space to actually open up everything. And we have all of these as well. It's really just a promotion, it looks like, to actually uh, download the game. Uh, so yeah, it's definitely very interesting. And uh, next up, we will have our actual packs here, but uh, we also have our cards too. So here is our cards. So we have our Bulbasaur, we have our Charmander, and we have our Squirtle promo as well. Definitely really nice, more so just a nice collector's piece. So yeah, really happy about that, it's definitely fantastic. Uh, so let's put these aside as well. And we have each of our code cards. So I hope you guys all enjoy this. Uh, this is just all for you. And uh, yeah, there we go. Let's, let's put that aside and let's see what we actually have. So I'm going to start on each side here and let's just find out what we actually get in this. I have no idea, just all anticipation at this point. So let's see. Code card for you guys. And top four? I think so. Maybe it's a top four. Might be the same as everything else. Yeah, there we go. It's top four. Um, and it all has Pokemon Go here, so it actually signifies uh, what set it's from in particular. Very nice here. Uh, it looks like it's already part of F format, so very nice. We have here uh, Zapdos as uh, our reverse holo. And we have Moltres as our regular holo as well. Very nice. Definitely very nice as a start. Uh, but nothing particularly special just yet. Let's go with the Charmander side and let's see what we actually have in this particular one. Uh, this is all just going to be new to me. I like that the artwork is slightly varied um, So that it looks a little bit different in a way 
So we have over here our code card for you guys, and let's see. Okay, that's a very interesting one, but let's find out what it actually is. A V-Star card, wow, okay. Not too sure about that, but I guess we have something new, something different. We have Spark here, very nice trainer. Uh, let's see, what else do we have in this particular one? Tranquil, we have here a Radiant Blastoise, wow. I feel like this is more special than I actually make it out to be here. Um, looks like it's on the reverse holo slot, so there's one more card behind, and oh my goodness, that is a Mewtwo V-Star. That looks awesome. It actually looks really cool here. Uh, absolutely exciting, yeah. I think this is uh this is this should be a lot more special than you think. It's a radiant blastoise. They wouldn't call it radiant if it wasn't anything uh, not special, you know. So yeah, this is definitely fantastic. I like this. So that's a really good pack. That's a really amazing pack. Um, wow. Alrighty, let's move on to the next. And this is the Bulbasaur side, so definitely already starting off really powerful there with the Charizard side of things. So I'm just gonna get this opened. And uh, code card for you guys. Top four cards to the bottom. Let's see what we have in this one. So it doesn't seem like much there yet, but let's see, War Turtle. Set our side there. Slowbro, we have uh, Melton, we have Bidoof, we have here Magikarp, uh, Pidov, we have Onyx, we have here our Tyranitar in reverse. Very nice artwork, you know. And we have, oh, that's nice. That's a Venusaur. I mean, it's a regular rare, but I love the artwork of this. It looks really nice, nice and dynamic. Uh, it's very vibrant as well, the colors. So, definitely very well done. The artwork is so unique with this, so yeah, just to see the differences in all that, already a great start. But let's move on and let's see what we have back in the Squirtle side of things as well. Let's get that open. Alrighty. Here's the code card for you guys. Enjoy. And we have top four cards to the bottom. Let's find out what we have in this one. Uh, Charmeleon, nice. Again, all Pokemon Go specific labeled there. I'm sure these are label, uh, legal to actually play. Uh, we have Tranquil as our reverse holo and, oh, nice. And Alolan Executor V. That's fantastic. In full art as well. So, uh, yeah, absolutely fantastic. I'm really loving this so far. Let's move on back to the Charmander pack. Alrighty, so, got the code card for you guys, enjoy, and we have our top four cards to the bottom, let's find out what we have here, Egg Incubator, very nice and interesting card, Lure Module as well, so you can see some very unique things only specific to Pokemon Go, so yeah, it's really nice there, that looks almost realistic, uh, we have Reverse Holo Charmeleon, very nice, and... Uh, just a regular rare Blissey, but uh, not too bad. I like how it's on top of a Pokemon Go gym, uh, so that's fantastic. It actually goes to show you how unique this particular set actually is. Um, so I'm absolutely loving this. It actually really excites me uh, in hopes to buy more of the Pokemon Go packs because they're just so unique, and I think being that this is just going to be a one-time thing, supposedly, uh, I think I just want to get as many of these as I possibly can. Don't know if it's gonna like, you know, take off in the future, but either way, it's so unique. I just gotta get more of these, you know. And seeing that I'm a little late to the game, yeah. I mean, you do what you can, right? But let's see what we actually have in this particular one as well. Uh, Magic Art. We have Spark in Reverse Hollow. Very nice, and. Oh, look at that. A slacking V. Uh, full art. Very fantastic. I don't know if every single holo we pull is going to be full art, but uh, I'm just going to take it and say it's going to be similar to the normal one. So getting a full art here, I think we're pretty uh, lucky to be getting that. So yeah, definitely uh, really great. But we have one pack left for each. So let's uh, end things really strongly here. 
back to the squirtle side and uh, let's find out what we have so it's the code card for you guys enjoy we have our top four cards to the top and let's find out what we have here uh oh pokey stop that's a very nice and interesting card um we have what's in this a new mail as our reverse and a tyranitar as our regular rare so uh nothing much to finish it there but that's okay we got a full art in this one very nice either way you know i mean this has been very exciting to open up it's just uh bringing back a lot of uh, fun memories you know so definitely really nice uh but let's get this pack opened up and see Alrighty, there we are so here is our code card for you guys enjoy we have the top four cards to the bottom and let's find out what we have in this one it seems like a lot of these cards are definitely uh familiar as we're getting along here so a bit of repetition which means that this could supposedly be a very small set uh, which is great i mean if you want play sets of cards it's a good way to get them we have a uh, glissopod which is our reverse hollow and Oh, there we go. We have our regular ultra rare uh, Concordeur V. Uh, so it's definitely a very nice one to get. So, uh, you know, not the best, but uh, also something that is just really fun to finish up on. So, yeah, can't complain about that. One pack left on the Bulbasaur side. So let's uh, finish things really strongly here. I'm excited. So let's find out. Alrighty, so let's get this opened up. Here's our code card for you guys. Hope you enjoy that. Ooh, I see another V-Star card. Maybe a special pack, but I don't know just yet. So here's our V-Star card. Lunatone, Ivysaur, we have Wall Turtle, Melton, uh, Eevee, we have our Pikachu, we have Squirtle, uh, Spinarak, we have our Reverse Hollow Chansey, and we finish things off with <laughs> another Concordor V. Wow, uh, that's very interesting. I mean, I won't complain about it. It's definitely uh, very nice either way. Um, but yeah, that was a really fun unboxing, a really fun opening of all of these. You know, really, ex you know, really enjoyable. And uh, I can't wait to open up a lot more of these. So. Yeah, absolutely fun video here. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this as much as I did. But with that being said, there is definitely more on the way. So do stay tuned. I hope to see you guys again in the near future. Uh, but with that being said, I hope you all have a fantastic day. I'll see you all next time.